But before I bring you righteous death, I am taking a quick 17-day vacation at my golf resort in Pyongyang. It's a great place to shoot golf or an uncle. But make no mistake, it's a working vacation. I will still be making every effort to destroy the world. Yo, what is up? This is your boy iGuru back with a new video. It's been a while, but uh, recently I got, received a message in my inbox and uh, there was some new shit going on, so I clicked on it and checked it out. And uh, it took me to the Wargaming website uh, where there was some new features going on, I suppose. And it was called Industrial Resources in Random Battles. Now, what is this about? So basically, what it is is you can now earn um, industrial resources for your clan uh, while you are playing tier 10 platoons with any clan member. Now with this, uh, I will explain to you what these industrial resources are used for and which is uh, what my subject uh, of today's video is, is why you should join a clan and why now is the best time that you, sh you can join a clan and uh, earn all these uh, incredible uh, bonuses and perks that go along with it. I noticed that recently Wargaming have been stepping up their game and trying to come up with innovative ideas to push their uh, player base towards their end, end content goals which is tier 10 clan wars and uh, competitive gaming and uh, they are trying to give you rewards to go along with that if you choose to participate and help to keep uh, promoting this uh, end game content. Now if you're part of a clan you can go to your uh, user interface and you click on the strongholds button and it will bring you to this page where you can see everything that goes on in your clan. Now on the top right of the screen below your uh, gold and your credits is treasury and storage. Treasury is how much gold you have in your clan and storage is how much industrial resources you have in your clan uh, to spend. And on the bottom of the screen is uh, what you spend your industrial resources on. So basically the industrial resources will help you buy this, this stuff here when you have them turned on. So you can buy 500% to free experience for two hours or you can buy two hours of 300 to 400 percent crew experience or 30 percent on rent 30 percent credit boosters on randoms and 75 percent credit boosters on um, strongholds and tournaments and clan wars or 100 percent combat experience boosters and then on the right uh, you can enable the industrial resources to buy air strikes and artillery strikes uh, that you can use for strongholds and uh, clan wars. To be honest with you, I've been uh, waiting for a long time to make a video like this uh, to promote uh, clan wars and uh, end game content about clans basically, but uh, there hasn't been a lot of good news uh, in the clan participation front, you know. Uh, all these years that we've been playing Clan Wars, the situation ha hasn't improved much. In fact, a lot of people say that the Clan Wars have been dying and there's been a lack of participation and uh, not much rewards that uh, justifies uh, participation or promotion. But uh, I've seen recently, it seems like more gaming is uh, going in this direction, which looks very promising. And if they pull it off, it might be uh, really good, not just for wargaming, but for the player base that uh, is loyal and loves uh, playing competitive esports, I guess, or you know, playing in the group with friends, uh, being in a clan. You actually can get rewarded handsomely now. I think it's they're trying to strike this balance where they can make money as well as reward those players who are uh, loyal to them and who stick around and make this game the awesome game that it is. As for me, I have been in this current clan for the last 14 months and I started off in this clan with only 3 tier 10 tanks 
and as of right now I have 26 which means in the past 14 months I have accumulated 23 tier 10 tanks I managed to grind them out and that's what Beacon Clan helps you do it completely accelerates your uh, grind towards the top because of the uh, boosters and perks that uh, you gain from being in a clan so the number one reason to play and join a clan is for the credit boosters these credit boosters help you accelerate credit earning by as much as 75 percent every game uh, right now you are witnessing a strongholds battle which uh, you can join with your clan or with anyone actually you can join your friends or whatever and uh, if your clan has the 75 percent boosters on I would typically earn let's say 40,000 credits with a premium tank and a premium account and plus the 75% uh, boosters you earn an additional 30,000 credits which means you earn 70,000 credits in one single game which takes about 2-3 minutes so in a typical 2 hour session of uh, tier 6 strongholds I earn about something like one and a half a million credits easily and uh, this is a clip of a couple of games we played in tier 8 strongholds and I don't know maybe there are 10 games there over an hour or so and uh, this is 865,000 credits of course this is with the premium account and in a premium tank which was the object uh, 252u or the defender you can easily get the same amount of credits uh, in a is5 which is a clan wars reward tank as well all right next up i'm going to show you the advances mode the advances mode is basically just like clan wars except uh, tier 10 this is 10 v 10 as opposed to 15 versus 15 in normal clan wars now in normal clan wars you earn gold by occupying provinces and defending them from people attacking them every day in advances mode this happens every once every weekend you don't even need to be in a clan to join advances mode you can join some other clan and be a legionnaire and basically at a specific time every every sunday like for us in southeast asia it it is uh between 9 p.m for the first session and uh, 10 p.m. for the second session and the advances mode comes on everybody logs in forms a team 10 versus 10 uh, the matchmaker will randomly match you with uh, equal or they try to balance out the uh, ELO ranking or whatever they try to make your opponent as close to you in ranking as possible in terms of uh, skill and uh, personal rating and what you do is uh, play like uh, clan wars clan wars like it's like clan wars tier 10 almost because uh, you only have 10 of you in uh, in an advances team so you match you're matched up against another 10 from another clan and you slug it out for like five games six games straight each game lasting about uh, five six minutes and uh, at the end of it your battle results will look something like this where your clan might earn like 20, 30,000 industrial resources which will then be used to purchase boosters and accelerate your uh, grinding credits, grinding XP, grinding free XP and in advances mode you even earn gold every weekend for free on top of the gold that you already earn from clan wars and did I mention you also make a lot of friends you learn how to play in a team environment and uh, learn how to win as a clan right now is the best time for you to join a clan and earn those uh, industrial resources to get you those clan boosters that are like your personal reserves on steroids also earn gold every weekend with the advances make friends and even earn industrial resources when you platoon in tier 10 platoons isn't that great hope you enjoyed the video thanks i'll see you again soon bye Watch sitting on a little hilltop. Eastlane, Roger.